échanges ah, un peu comme ça. Oui, c'est parce que j'ai vu. Oui, oui, d'accord. Ouais, c'est ça que je voulais faire. Most of people believe that because of internet and mobile telephony, we are already living in a global village. But is it really true? Well, no. Do you know, for instance, that almost 3 billion people are still not yet connected and they cannot enjoy things as simple as video streaming? So we are not yet at the end of the journey. The dream of full connectivity is still ahead of us. On one hand, people still want higher bandwidth. On the other, there are still situations, geographies, where connectivity stays unfulfilled. And not to mention specific situations where communication is all that makes the difference. Firemen, police, rescue forces, army, they all work in situations where threats and challenges have never been as high as they are today. And this situation requires they can communicate. So the connected world, we need to allow you to stay connected to communicate, to exchange all data you need, wherever you are, whatever you're doing, whatever your mission is. To achieve this vision, innovation is key. In a few years from now, a new satellite will provide high bandwidth to 30 sub-Saharan countries in Africa. We are also developing innovative platforms, stratospheric balloons. We are providing new solutions for connected airlines, and of course, we are developing new generation for the armies. But communications can't go without privacy and security. It does matter for you as a person, but it does matter as well for the organizations and the countries. So the world of tomorrow will not only be connected, it has to be a secure world as well. Would you trade your security with connectivity? We wouldn't.